start it. What's up, guys? My psych here, and today I'm going to be doing a part two of tips and tricks. I am. This is going to be a series, depending on if I can even find any more tips and tricks. Um. So yeah, let's just jump right into it. The first one I'm going to show you. Like, it's pretty straightforward, but it's a really good tip for when you're in gunfights, especially from far away or anything like that. So, basically, what it is, is headshots. Um, headshots in this game are surprisingly effective, especially if you had that head, if you have the headshot perk. Um, if you have a gun like my FAL or the Copperhead, it has this zoom-in ability so you can get easy headshots. Okay, so this FAL... It's a three burst kill. It has enough recoil that if you shoot someone in their chest, it will go up to their head sooner or later. As you can see, they're like kind of flinching, and then you can shoot their head by accident. But what I'm going to teach you is really focusing on your headshots, especially from far away, because it can get them down in one, I think, one burst or one and a half burst. All right. So go over there. Go far away. So basically, I'm just going to be showing you this this headshot, these headshots, because they're extremely effective. So, as you can see on my screen, if someone's popped up like that, and you have that, you have that grappling hook type of dot in the middle, you're going to want to line that up first. With snipers, let's say there's a sniper halfway across the map, and he's popped up like that, getting ready to snipe you or anyone else. This is really effective. This little small small dot and you being covered is really effective because you can just pop up and one burst them in their head as like like that. Now, um, I'm gonna kill you and you're gonna come back here and do it again. So I'm just gonna the next one I'm gonna demonstrate you is let's say you miss um let's say you just miss your full clip on a headshot because people will be moving. So let's say let's say you miss that. Alright, so stay right there. Pop up. So remember, you're gonna want to keep it on. But let's say you just pop up quick, and you get the first headshot, and after you move away, see? Don't mess with me. That wasn't a headshot, but you really want to get your headshots going. It's really, 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 really effective. Really effective. Okay. So that was pretty straightforward, but it's a really good technique. Second one I'm gonna show you is pretty straightforward also it's, it's really simple mechanics in the game um but it's, it's still a really big tip so i'm gonna do this one and it's rolling while changing your weapon so if you're shooting at someone and you're running out of ammo right running out of ammo you know that you can't kill this person in that much bullets if someone's shooting at you you're gonna really want to just roll away change your weapon and pop them a couple times dropped one Shooting shooting them in the head is a really really good idea really good idea like headshots in this game are really effective I don't really remember them being as effective in this game than in uncharted one and three I mean um two and three I mean um, These are really really good te um, Techniques really really good. So remember run out of ammo or you just want to change your weapon So let's say you're on your pistol shooting or you're missing a couple bullets You're just like oh, I'm just gonna change the weapon to something that can hip fire really good even though the foul really can't It's gonna roll change your weapon. So if person's shooting at you, they'll mess up their aim and Then just shoot at them and kill them Okay, this next one I'm gonna um, I'm gonna let Rush Boy demonstrate it. It's rolling while throwing grenades. So basically, what's gonna happen is he's just gonna walk away. I'm gonna be behind him. I'm gonna hit him, and he's gonna roll away as I'm getting ready to hit. And then after, he's gonna drop a grenade right behind me. So running up on him, running up on him, getting ready to hit. He's gonna roll away and drop a grenade. Alright, that's what's gonna happen. So let's do it right now. Running up, running up, hit. He's gonna roll away, throw a grenade. So. If you do that method quick enough, the person will be stopped in this animation right here, right? It's going to be hard for them to roll away, especially if there's cover, because in this game, you really get attached to cover like this, and they're going to die like that. Or if they have a charged grapple, and after you hit it, it's really hard to go away, unless they have that that um, perk on that makes them roll away a little bit faster after that. Okay, that that um rolling method also works if you jump instead of rolling. So basically throwing grenade, 
and jumping instead of rolling or if you're here jump off it and throw a grenade it works now another nade one is basically grappling hook um grappling hooking away and then meleeing so let's you're up here having a little battle right just throw down your grenade grapple hook away so you don't get damaged by it come back oh wait i messed up a little oh go over here come here come back double tap um square and just end them extremely good method um, not much people know about how you can just swing on grappling hook and double tap square because it shows you that you can do it if you go come close to someone but it doesn't show you to double tap square I believe it doesn't show you that so remember you can just double tap square or I think come come below me also if you climb up you can just jump down but remember that it's only gonna give you a KO so these are all my tips and tricks for this video guys I hope you enjoy this tip and trick and I hope I get to see some of you guys use these tips and tricks on me Ooh. oh I uh, trust me guys I'm not bad at the game it's just I wasn't expecting it see roll away Smash them. Okay, close enough of you. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, later.